welcome back to Fool Us. And it's time for us to meet our next magician. Richard Bellas. Hi, I'm Richard Bellas. Uh, I've been doing magic for 22 years. Uh, the type of magic I perform is a mixture of either close-up, sleight of hand, or mind control. If you can imagine the Artful Dodger learning how to do magic, that's pretty much my style. Uh, last time I was on the show, I got royally busted, mainly because I used an off-the-shelf trick. I was cheeky, I had a bit of fun. First of all, the whole study of psychology and implanting thoughts in people's heads is bull****. And this time it'll be different. I'm going to bring the best I've got to the table. I came up with the idea for this routine in a dream I had, and this time I will for Penn and Teller. To try and fool Penn and Teller once is brave. To come back and try and do it again is verging on insanity. So please welcome the very nearly mad Richard Bellows. <laughs> It was quite clear last time we met, you burnt me pretty bad. And I deserved it, I didn't try hard enough. Um, and it haunted me for a while until I had a dream of a routine that I could do to you guys should we meet again. And so clear was a dream that I went out and placed a bet on the outcome. And that's where this case comes in. Teller, would you mind looking after this for me? Uh, placing it on your chair. And could you both join me up on stage? That'd be great. Give me a hand, guys. Put in Teller. And also, I'll need Jonathan as our referee. Uh, the dream basically raised one question, which was who would win in the challenge between Penn and Teller? We know you work perfectly as a team. I want to know who's the actual talent. So I devised a couple of challenges. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I'm hoping one of them is wrestling. <laughs> I can change it. I can change it. So uh, the first challenge is uh, darts. Have you played before? I've thrown darts, but I've yeah, never yeah. Played. Okay. Seriously. Well, come on over, John. If you can stand here, uh, come on over, guys. What we have: uh, circular board, 62 mm -hmm. different sections of scoring. Uh -huh. Our rings double, inner rings treble. The yes. bullseyes worth 50, and so on. Uh, you're going to get three darts each. Mm -hmm. Highest score wins. You're going to go first. Okay. So those are your darts. Okay. As we say in darts, it's game on. Jonathan will keep score. Good luck. Going for the high score, right? Yeah, absolutely. Maybe I should tell you after what I'm going for. <laughs> <laughs> one. Good. Wow. I was going for Tell I'm going for you, Teller. One. One. That's 14, so you've got 15. 15. Oh. And that is in the... Uh, is that, what's that? Is that 19? Yes. So that's uh, 34. 34, give it a hand. 34. 34. There you go. I'll get those for you. We're running out of chalky stuff. Good luck. Are we good? Okay, uh, 34 to beat. You can do it with one die if you're good enough. <laughs> no pressure. Okay, that's, that's on the board. You're playing American rules. <laughs> <laughs> oh, treble. just outside the triple 13. You've got to get a double or a treble. It's or a ball. Me. Another 13, 26. 26. Got... Uh, give me a hand, guys. That's Pretty a great good. score. Yes, yes, yes! The second game is more about using your mind, so really it should be more up your street. No offence. Um, <laughs> so this is like a really weird edition of the Generation game, isn't it? <laughs> we hope so. Uh, we'll come over to Challenge 2, guys, which is over here. Um, I don't know which one you stand. I think you stand on particular sides, but pen okay, on this yeah, side, tell on this side. What you have... You've got to think, you've got 20 seconds to think of a six-letter word. Then take the letters and pop it up on there. A six-letter word. Six-letter word. Take your time, but the audience are going to decide who's his best by cheering the loudest. OK, so that's down 20 to them. seconds. 20 seconds, starting from now. Go. And I'm, I'm, I have no idea what word they're going to go for, and um, you're going to be the judge. So I'll who's judge loudest. from so, the cheers yes. as to which word you think is the best. <laughs> that's looking good. Hey, no cheating. <laughs> Who thinks toilet is the better word? Yeah, that's great. Oh, okay. there's, a, there's a lot of love for toilet in the room. Uh, for housey. Who likes housey better? It's, it's toilet all the way. Yes. Well, well, give me a hand. Who won that round? It's your turn. So that's one all. Come back in the middle, 
guys. I'll tell you if you join me here. Pen, if you can stand here for me. Uh, there was a winner in my dream, so we've got to decide this, who's going to be our, our champion. So we'll do it how grown men should. Rock, paper, scissors. Okay. Okay? Okay. okay you've got to put your hand behind your back, and you've got to either do scissors, rock, rock or paper, paper, scissors. On three, not after three. Okay. One, two, three. <laughs> One, two, three. Oh, oh, there you go. So Teller wins paper over rock. Paper wins rock, beats rock over rock. Teller is our winner. And successful. And Teller's face, that purpose is based there. Uh, what we did was to have a prediction, which you couldn't see the whole way through, but were you guys watching? No one went over there and so on. Okay, would you mind bringing that prediction up to the table? And one more time, guys, can you give it up for Tella, our winner? Let's get here. You stay there, I think. Who's on here for me? Perfect. Could you please click those open for me? I don't want to touch the locks. Uh, inside here is something that you'll need in just a second. Only? Pick that up for me. Oh, I don't like where this is heading. Well, if he's Thank managed to get it up there, he is a magician. Uh, no, I think keep it in a very safe place, so I'll uh, just... Would you, would you like me to put on a German accent? <laughs> <laughs> I'll be honest, a little bit. Uh, no, here's the idea. Um, I kept it in my shoe, and I, 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 I was a bit nervous, I was a bit sweaty. I want you to go in after it. OK. OK, so let everyone see. I'm going to just take this off very fairly... If you could... There. Just pick that up and show them the laces, and they can see inside. Uh, tip it up the other oh, way. Oh man! Inside there is a piece of paper. There is. And I want you to be very fair when you open that. I have in my hands a piece no of paper. No funny biz. Okay. That's quite hard. I, I kind of predicted what would happen okay. if you guys played darts, if you guys did some words. Uh, oh. The dart score. What did we get? Okay, I'm going to fold it over for maximum oh, okay, sure. defense. If you can see that, there, it says darts. Pen scores 34. Teller scores 26. Thank you very much. And over here we had uh, two words. It was um, Penn's words. What was your word on this? If I move down, it's, it says words. Penn's word, housey. Housey. Teller's word, toilet. toilet. Thank you. But then there was a draw, so we had to do paper, rock, scissors, and Teller, you won the tiebreak. It's at the bottom. Teller wins. I guess Teller dreams wins. do come true. I'll collect my winnings. Thank you very much. Well done, sir. It was awesome. Come on the front here. Sure. I'm hoping, I'm hoping some people who weren't Magic fans maybe tuned in, saw some darts, thought great darts, I'm going to stay for that. <laughs> How confident are you? Do you think you fooled them? I think I've done all I can to fool them. Whether I have or not is, is up to them. Okay, but we'll I couldn't have done it any now. better. Pen, don't just ignore me. I'm not going away. I'm ignoring you. We've got work to do. You've got to... No, you've this got to do This was hard. We were on stage, It's dude. hard. That's the whole point. It's meant to be hard. Come on. Eyes front. Tell us still thinking. Either that or he's got some wind. Guys. <laughs> uh, that's enough time, girls. Okay. I'm going to have to push it. Uh, what we have... The reason it took so long is because we're having trouble. And we are not by any means sure how it's done. I believe you wrote the prediction yourself. And I believe you used a, some variation on a little thing that allows you to write in your hand secretly. Mm. And I think you're really, really good at it. Teller thinks you couldn't possibly be that good at using that gimmick. We both believe that the prediction went from your right pocket down your leg and load it into the shoe. I did not write it, I'll be honest about that. But I also did not cop it and I did not use my pocket at all. Did not use your pocket at all? It okay. never went down his leg. Then you, sir, even more than we thought, <laughs> have fooled us. Yes! yes!
Richard, wouldn't it be awful if this was just another dream? dream. And you <laughs> Uh, it's break time again, but don't go away because we will be right back here with a trick where Penn encases Portella's head in a solid concrete block. Now that is a great Saturday night I in can't right wait there. To see that. Yeah, see you soon. <laughs>